my channel, I'm Scarlet Queen, your host. And today we're doing another haul video because for the life of me, I can't find any time to edit some more gaming vids. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got for my birthday and throughout October time for my house and uh, just some clothing items and stuff. Super excited to share this with you. And welcome to my kawaii rainbow attempt at being cute. I don't even know. Let's just jump right into it, as all the other YouTubers say. My first item is going to be these adorable little cushions that my friends actually got me for my birthday. Got two of them and they normally go on my bed. Very, very pretty, very pastel, very soft. Then I got this adorable little strawberry cushion that is so cute. It's actually from like one of our like really cheap stores. I think it was like 99 Rand or something. And super adorable, really red and green and Stunning. <laughs> it sits on my bed as well. Then, all the way from the UK, I have this adorable little unicorn kitty coat hanger from a brand called Sass and Bell in the UK. And this is gonna go on the back of my door and hopefully house a handbag or something. I'm not sure yet. Next up, also from Sass and Bell, is this amazing rainbow carpet. <laughs> that when I was there in August, I saw and I was like, yes, this is life. I need this carpet. And it was super cheap, it was like six pounds, which is like 60 Rand. That's, sorry, what is six times 20? Hundred and twenty rand. <laughs> really, really cute. Really colorful. I'm probably gonna put it at like the end of my bed. It's not a bath mat material, and it's hundred percent cotton, so I don't think I can like wet it and stuff. Maybe I put it in my bathroom. Then our last homeware item is this cute little like frame thing with the glittery sparkles and shit in it. Come on, who doesn't like some adorable pink little? flowers and sparkly bits and it says let's do this i'm gonna put it somewhere where it can motivate me in the daytime because hell knows motivation has been hella low <laughs> the last of my homework items that wasn't the last one sorry is this <laughs> cute little light up unicorn <laughs> That's like, I guess, like a night light. And it changes colors, which is really cool. Only thing it doesn't do is sing me to sleep. But it's going on my bedside table. All right, let's get into the accessories and clothing items. I got these two cute, like, bandana vibes. This really pretty white and blue striped one with this yellow accent on the end. It's supposed to be on your head like that swiggity swooty girl from the 80s. I don't know. Uh, and then I got another one, and this one is from Zara, which was obviously a little more expensive, but also sort of like pastel colors with this beautiful like pink and the white, really cute. This was 190 bucks, and the other one was like, it's from Claire's, I think it was like 120. And then because I am super extra at the moment and like color is life, I got this little choker also from Claire's they have like a three for two special so or is it one for three I don't know <laughs> what a three for two special and so I got this one and then I got this one as well which has these cute little flowers on it very pretty and the other jewelry I got wait a minute who are you? I apparently got this from Claire's as well. I mean, it's supposed to be three for two, but I got four. So there's this one too, which is just these cute little bangles. And then from, <laughs> I think this is from the Mr. Price kitty section. Listen guys, I don't know what to tell you. Kitty sections are my favorite. So there's this cute little necklace with these little flowers on that comes with a bangle that has flowers on and a ring as well. LMG, and this was like 30 bucks. Shopping at the kids section is like such a blessing. I fit in kitties, kitties shoes, cause I'm only a size six and like they still have girls shoes size six. And their shoes are always cheaper by like 200 to 400 Rand, like easily. And I'm just like, yeah. 
pink sparkles and cheap shoes and stuff. So I'm normally in the kitty section when it comes to accessories and shoes. And socks if they fit. And next item, also from Mr. Price, are these adorable little ice cream rainbow socks with the cone at the bottom. And super cute, 20 bucks. I'm like excited to wear these in the summer. It's gonna be adorable. And the last item from Mr. Price is this cute rainbow bag accessory. It's like a key ring, super rainbow, super colorful. Colorful, my English. I love it. Then, there's this really awesome, like, store that I never knew existed in the garden, like, one of our, I don't know, one of the malls here in Cape Town. And they do, like, small business items, like, here from Cape Town, like, local, local items. So I thought I'd support them, and I mean, I saw this that literally says, send nudes on it, but, like, nudes like noodles. And I was like, yes. This needs to be in my closet. Then there is this adorable little like handmade, it says handmade felt friend at the back, which was 160, I think the pin was 60. Oh, this is a little pricey for the items, but I thought I'd support and I really like these. Really, really cute. After I bought it, I realized that it has a name. Because I was about to name it. And then I realized it has a name. And it freaking says Queenie on it. Like, hello? That is perfect for me, Scarlet Queen. I didn't even realize. So I think like I might like de-attach. De de-attach? I don't even know what you call that. I'm gonna take this little strippy thing off and then like sew it onto like my jean jacket or something with all of the sh stuff on it. Onto the clothing items that I got. First off, we have this amazing iridescent jacket from Zara. So it was quite pricey. I think I uh, I took off the label already because I did wear it the other day. It was about like 596 or 570 or something. 570 Rand. Really really cool like super duper shiny and when I saw this I was like yes give me the shine. My next item is this lemon dress from H&M. Just a really cute little summer dress. Just got these straps at the top. They were selling these for 99 Rand. And I was like, bitch gonna get her a lemon dress. And it's super cute. Next up, I have some items from Dolls Kill in the States. And this first one is from Delia S. Delia's. I'm not really sure. I guess it's Delia's. And it is this this adorable little crop top with this rain bee on the front. I mean, hello. It's got this really pretty like ribbed style and like baby blue color. Damn girl, gonna look fine in summer and this though. And the next item from Dolls Kill is this cute little... They were having a sale, okay? I couldn't not. The things were like... $10 each. I'm sure if I remember correctly. Because there's no label on it that said how much I bought it for. This was probably like $11. I think this was like 8 or 10 So that's like 100 bucks or like 120 It's a little cheaper buying in the US than in the UK. And it's this little cute little strappy top with these aliens on it. Which is just adorable and pink. And like actually like a really nice material. I mistook these sizes a little bit because like each size guide is different for like every brand on Dolls Kill. So this is an XL. It fits really well. This is an L and it's too big. So I don't know. I'm confused. Then from Sugar Thrills, which I think this is, this is also from Sugar Thrills, sorry. This other one from Sugar Thrills is this adorable cherry slip dress. Now, I may have bought it a little big and oh my gosh, it is adorable, but it is definitely a little big. So I'm going to show it to you guys and then I'm probably going to have it made smaller just so it actually fits my body. Unfortunately, it's like a little see-through. I thought it would be like a bit thicker so I could wear it out. Um, I have seen a lot of people wearing it out regardless, so I'll probably try that. Just find like something to wear it under something to wear underneath, or maybe like tuck it into something. But super cute, and look at all the cherries. 
Also from Dove's Kill, the last item that I got from them is these adorable pastel rainbow socks that I think was about $8 and it was like more expensive or like just as expensive as the clothes which don't make any sense but the clothes were on sale the socks weren't on sale they were just released then from Juju UK which is like a jelly shoes brand I got these and OMG they are super cute I cannot wait to wear them this summer, like adorable, super cute, super stylish. I love this kind of like thing for summer especially. A nice open toed shoe with some cute socks under is like bomb diggity, fla, fresh, feeling foolish. I can't wait to wear these either. I didn't want to show these because I was hoping to do like a lazy oaf haul at the end of the year. But basically lazy oaf is like a, another independent brand from the UK. They've become sort of like not commercial but like really overpriced at the moment for their items. Uh, I think they used to be a little more affordable but either way I got these adorable so let me explain. They were having a sale, right? And when I first saw this jersey, I'm like, I need like 10 of them so that when I wear it, I can wear them for the rest of my life. And damn, how gorgeous is this jersey? Can we talk about this? And it's pastel as all heck. And just tucked in to a nice skirt or like anything into jeans, whatever you want is super adorable. I think they were going for 10 pounds on the um, on the sale. I'm so glad I got a couple more. So I have three now. Other ones in my cupboard. <laughs> the other lazy off item I got is these adorable slippers, but we couldn't fit them in the package from the UK. So I'm only getting them in Christmas and technically, you know, it's summer. So what am I gonna be doing with these adorable warm slippers in summer? And then I did get some makeup items as well that I'll just share with you guys really briefly. Obviously, we don't get Fenty Beauty in our own country, but I did get I did get the Fenty Beauty Matchsticks Shimmer Highlighter. Skin Stick Matchstick Shimmer Highlighter. I don't know, in color confetti. And yeah, it looks like this. Super pretty. I have used this. It is on my face today. Can we admire the highlighter? Gosh darn is it adorable. Then I got Urban Decay's All Nighter Setting Spray, which basically is like one of the best rated at the moment. It looks like this on the inside, and yeah, excited to finally try it out. Then I did get the Professional Makeup Primer by Benefit. It looks like this, and it is also one of the highest rated at the moment. And this one smells like freaking peaches and I'm like yes give it to me it was almost 500 rand for this small tube what am I doing with my life <laughs> then I also got the Urban Decay heavy metal eyeliner and I got the color grind and it is also on my face today really cute works really really well just to add that little extra shine. This is what it looks like with this really pretty pink shimmer. And last but not least, I got some awesome gaming gear from one of my viewers actually. Thank you so much for that. He gave me the Razer Invicta mouse pad. Really, really cool, really pretty. I've been using it now for quite a while and it's awesome. Really enjoying it. And he also got me the Razer Basilisk mouse, which I've also been using. So it was a bit of an adjustment going from like having like six buttons on the side to only like three and like had to change all my controls around and shit like that. Um, but yeah, really cool, really loving the pink and super pretty. He also gave me an amazing screen and I'm really thankful for having some extra gaming gear because obviously a screen has definitely helped with my streaming. And yeah, thanks to everyone who has bought me birthday presents and who spoiled me throughout October. Thanks for all the support recently. Everybody on Twitch and on Patreon and stuff, you guys give me life. Thank you so much. And yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe. I should be getting back to making gaming vi gaming videos and like more travel vlog stuff. Just been sort of swamped with life shit. And thanks so much for joining me guys. This was Scarlet Queen, your host, and until next time, bye!